Hi guys, welcome to my crazy life. It's Lori and Alex. And we have a Dollar Tree haul for you today. I found some fun, kind of some unique things that I've not seen before. Um, so I wanted to share them with you. So I just spilled. I got some Carolina the pork rinds, sweet and mild. They're delicious. I don't like the Brims brand, but I like the Carolina. This could be a short haul. I don't have a lot of stuff, but I did want to share with you. Um, I found the ice skates. I love ice skates. So I think I need to find a place for these guys just to set them out somewhere. Um, I found the regular tartan plaid and then I got the black and white. And they're adorable. The only thing is they're, these are plastic. I mean, but whatever. They could at least have been plastic silver. But I like them. So I grabbed one of each of those. I'm telling you, every time I go, I just find one or two new ornaments. Um, I got some Curad box of alcohol wipes. These are two-ply pads. I don't know what, what the alcohol... It's 70. 70% 70 isopro isopropic, iso whatever, alcohol. Um, I use these for my diabetes care when I get myself shots or check my blood sugar, but also for my nails. So if I take off, like if I lose a fake nail, I use alcohol to clean my nail bed so it's oil free and they stick on longer. So I grabbed two boxes, one to keep with my, my diabetes stuff and one to keep with my nail stuff. Duh. And for a dollar, you get a hundred pads, which is fantastic. Um, I had to hunt those down. I was out of the last batch I bought. But they're good also for my diabetes care. I picked up for Thanksgiving a three-pack of these. Um, they're just to-go containers. But what I will do is make my broccoli in this to take to my brother's house. And then I can just leave it there and I don't have to worry. I like doing that. Um, I grabbed some more coffee cups. I love these guys. I don't know if I've ever showed them to you. They have the thicker styrofoam ones, but I really just like these because they're plain and white. So you get just a plain white cup. And then you get one of these. It says coffee, a little hand thing to keep your hand from burning, but you can decorate these. And if you have like littles and you want to make them some hot chocolates and you're going to go look at Christmas lights, you can give them some markers, give them a plain cup, let them decorate it before you head out. And then they know whose cup is whose. I just like, for me, I like the plain white. I think it goes with any of any decor um, inside you get a sealed bag of all the extra cardboards, or if you have the fabric sleeves, which I do from last year at Target, they fit on here perfectly fine. And what I like to have these on hand for is on the go, because then I can just toss them away and I don't have to worry. So I have three packages of them now. That will last me some time, but I'm also gonna put it on my board for Christmas. Um, I grabbed some walnut halves. You get a two ounce package, which I think is enough to make one batch of the, they're either Italian wedding cookies, Mexican wedding cookies, snowballs, depending where you live. Oh, my fire's going out. Well, it'll start back up. So I think that's enough walnuts for the recipe, but if not, I think I have some more. I can just pick up another bag. I'm not making a ton of cookies this year, so that package is perfectly fine. I don't know why my oven timer just went off. I better go check. I'm back. Not the microwave. I mean, not the oven, it was a microwave. I'm cooking some rice cauliflower for dinner. I'm a mess, guys. I'm tired. Okay. I found some fun little things. Um, Sarah and I are going to be doing some little crafty bits on Thanksgiving for Christmas. And I'm like, girl, we need to make a reindeer. 
So I grabbed us each one of these fun little kits. Um, I will do in my vlog from Monday, um, you will see all of the stuff that we're gonna do on Thanksgiving. And while I'm at it, I found these little air dry clay kits and avocados. So we'll each have one of those to do. My plan is um, Thanksgiving evening, we're gonna put on some Christmas movies. We'll have our charcuterie board. We have some crafts to do. And then um, we're gonna make our list for Christmas on what we need for the cottage. Cottage for the cottage. But these looked fun. So I grabbed this kit and this kit. And to go with it, I grabbed one more glue. I have one upstairs, so we each have some glue. I guess I could get the hot glue out, but I think we're gonna be sitting down here watching movies, so we'll just use liquid glue and let it dry. And this is a good brand. It's Bostic Multi-Purpose Adhesive. This is good for paper crafting, but it also is good for crafts, wood, paper, fabric. That is not yours. Fabric dries clear, non-toxic, safe for children, and washable. So I grabbed another one so we each have our own to craft with. The boys are driving me batty, guys. I found for Murray and Mabel one more. I thought they each deserved, I don't know where the other one is, here it is. They each needed their own fish taco and hot sauce. So I grabbed one more, one for Murray and, and one, so Mabel will have a set and Murray. My, those are my brother's kittens. They'll have their own set and wait to see what I got to put them in. Oh, I thought I had another ornament and I did. I found the gnome with the little hat on a plastic jingle bell. How cute is that? I thought this was adorable. I'll probably put this on the tree. I didn't put up a tiered tray or I would put it in the tiered tray, but I saw these. This was the only colors I saw at my store, but I love the hats. I mean, this is definitely better quality than a dollar. Um, at my store, they only had two left. And his little nose. I love it. So I grabbed that. You know, just to have. Now, I need to tie these up. And I've been keeping the cat presents in the garage. But I did buy them a banana. So they have here until they open Christmas. Like I said, this is a pretty small haul. But we're going to go through it. Um, I couldn't find the Vaseline that I saw everybody hauling of this the creamy petroleum jelly, but I got the, um, this is Care All brand for dry skin absorbs quickly. Um, it is, it is cream. Hmm. It doesn't smell bad at all. What does it smell like? My hands are so dry. I want to say it almost smells like cocoa butter. But it's supposed to be good, and what I will do before I go to bed is slather my fingers with it to try to get the moisture, keep them from cracking. Right now, I just have my thumb that's cracked, so I'm trying to help with that. But it feels soft, it's not heavy, and it is creamy petroleum jelly, vitamin E enriched skin softener for dry skin, absorbs quickly. Um, I don't know what Carol brand is, but I grabbed this, it was in my beauty section. And that's what it looks like, but it is, it doesn't smell bad at all. And it definitely um, is light, which I like, but it's also my hands feel moisturized, so that is good. He's, they're now smelling the treats over here. I grabbed some bacon bits. Fun fact, bacon bits don't really have meat in them. These are considered vegan. Scare me. I don't know, and there's a the microwave again. These are vegan bacon, bacon bits. I just like them to have around the house. So I grabbed some of those. Also, I found these are new in my craft section and they're like llama pit. They're calling them wood clips. They're, on, they're llamas on paper clip or on uh, clothes pins, but the little pieces are wood. They're not, typically you're gonna get these and it's fabric but those are paper these are wood little llamas and then i got a set of succulents this is what they all only had at my store were these two and you obviously get 10 pieces but i thought they were super fun i don't know if it's garland 
I don't know. There is, I can't tell. Let's open it. We have time. Yeah, there's a piece of twine. So they must, you must hang them up like garland. But I mean, this is wood. It's very, very good quality. I'm surprised, honestly. I mean, typically when I buy these, they're pretty chintzy, you know. I mean, they're good for what they are, but. So they do come with what I would assume is a garland if you want to hang them and then maybe hang pictures from them or something. That would be fun too if you have a teenager that's into like the succulents or, you know, the, out, the llamas. That would be a fun stocking stuff or, or for an advent. Like this could be a fun thing to put in one of the advent bags. Um, I got this self-adherent wrap. I think it's considered like a vet tape. It's Curad brand. And we're also going to open this. It's Curad brand. And I feel like it's what the doctors use when I get my blood taken. So it is in a... I mean, I don't know if it's sterile. Yeah, that's what it is. It's like that tape that, it's called vet wrap, so it sticks to itself. There's no adhesive, so if you have a cut or you need to hold a Band-Aid on or whatever. I thought it was interesting. I like the color, you know, definitely not hot pink, although I don't mind hot pink. Um, Iron Man, official sponsor of Iron Man. So, uh, sticks to itself without adhesion, easily tears by hand. So I think that's great for somebody's first aid kit. I'm going to put it in my first aid kit. I didn't want to take it out of the plastic because if it's sterile, I want to leave it sterile. So that's going to go upstairs into my first aid kit. Let's see. Do I have anything else? Food stays downstairs, right? Right. All right. Now the fun stuff couple things I found for some stockings and that's it. I didn't really find a lot of stuff today, but I think what I did find is fun. So first and foremost, for one of my coworkers, I got her one of these prayer boxes for her little gift bag and it says, give it to God. And inside it says, I am the Lord who heals you, Exodus 1526. And it comes with a small little mechanical pencil and a little note card. And you can, I mean, a little, note sheets so you can write down on here what you're giving to God to help you with and then you close it up in there and leave it I thought that was super nice so I got that for one of my co-workers now guys I'm dying here I found something and this is what I'm putting the cat stuff in for my for Murray and Mabel they are shark stockings the heck they're sharks I mean what cat doesn't need this to be their stocking and I love them now I won't it's like a linen fabric so I don't think I can iron their names on it and I'm okay with that but the quality is phenomenal and look at the size of that hanger like come on is that not adorable so I got one in gray and one in this like tealy green blue color for the for the two cats even the button eyes like the eyes are a real button I mean, this is this is decent quality guys for one dollar i mean that's a gift bag for them so i'll keep the taco truck box and just throw the cat toys in it here and i'm putting their treats and toys in here when i stop stuff their stockings which i cannot do till closer to christmas because my cats will get into their toys I also have to, trust me, my cats will get plenty this year, but um, this is for, for the Murray and Mabel kitties, so I got to put this out in the garage with the rest of their stuff, and then I just have a couple things, three little items I want to show you, and in my advent calendar, I was talking about doing like Legos or something, but this is a little, um, like a little Lego kit, but they're mega constructs the Dollar Tree brand, and you build one of each of those trucks. Like, how fun would that be in an Advent? For a dollar a day, if you did a 12-day Advent, $12, and the child would have so much fun with these little things. So I grabbed this one, and then I found another one there. This is a Minions, um, the Rise of Gru 
Splathams, but it comes with a launcher and a bullseye or a thing you launch them through. So you try to get them through the hole and they're sticky. And it comes with everything included for $1. I mean, a couple of these, some candies, that's an advent calendar right there and any kid would love it. And the surprise and excitement leading up to the holidays would be fantastic. And then if you have one, I'm dying here, guys. I'm absolutely dying. I had this doll when I was little and I absolutely loved it. I'm gonna take it out of the box. Um, I wanted the brown hair, so I got the brown haired girl. But I am telling you now, this is killing me. I'm gonna have to, I'm gonna have to do something. This is how I learned to put makeup on. This is how I, and it comes with, I can't get it open. Come on. All right, here it comes. Uh, one doll head and one comb. The heck? Dollar tray. Are you serious? It's a doll head. And it, you can do its hair. What the Hades? I had to have the brown haired lady. She's lovely. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me right now? What? Put this in an advent, a stocking. Any little person would love this. I did rip out some hair or did I pull it? Oh, I didn't rip out hair. I pulled it out of its ponytail. So let's take it out. We'll have to put it in a new ponytail. Okay, I can't get out this pony. It's got a very tight elastic. All right, I'm just taking out its hair. And then when it's time, we'll put it, okay. Here is one thing I will tell you. I just got a little freaked out. Um, but it's okay. It's okay. Look at this. How fun is this? What the heck? And then if you want to put it back up, we're just going to put it back up in its ponytail. Guys, I don't know what little person. And get some hair scrunchies and some hair ties. What little person wouldn't have so much fun with one of these? Even if it's just for a couple hours. Leading up to the holiday season. And then maybe you get them a, a full size one. I don't know. Okay, well, I'm losing her hair tie, so I'm going to have to get some, some scrunchies for mine. Because this is going on my desk at work. All right, my office upstairs. If I'm stressed out, I'll start brushing Barbie's hair or whatever her name is. So there, I got her, the hair back up in a pony. How adorable! Guys, one stinking dollar, like one dollar. And I'm telling you, if you have a, somebody who wants to do hair or loves brushing hair and doing makeup and all of that, get them one of these. Get a mix of things at the Dollar Tree. Don't sleep on the toy section, but get in there fast because this stuff is going to go. All right, that is everything I bought today at the Dollar Tree. Um, yeah. And I hope you have a fantastic Thanksgiving if I don't talk to you before then. Have a good one. Bye.